Welcome back to Australia by Design Innovations. Which projects will our design industry judges select to go through to the final? Time now to go bush with a caravan. The Track T4 off-road caravan does exactly what it says. Anybody who's tried to drag a caravan with their four-wheel drive into the scrub, through creeks, will know what I'm saying. This will do it. We hear a lot about manufacturing in Australia being on the decline. I don't buy that for a second. It's the smart manufacturers who really get designed who are succeeding. We design everything from the ground up, including our chassis and suspension system, which we've been developing over the last 20 years. This allows us to overcome things like bump steer. Bump steer? <laughs> no, no, bump steer. When most traditional suspension systems hit a bump, what happens is that wheel is moved rearward as well as upward. And the effect of that is, is it steers the, the camper or caravan in that direction. What we have is what we call self-steering geometry. What happens is as that wheel goes into bump, it also tows in, which allows the trailer to track straight and behave well behind the tow vehicle. So I guess that's a massive innovation. Yeah, you hardly know the vans on behind. You really have to use your suppliers to produce quality parts that we can now assemble like the Meccano set. And this must be the, uh, the convertible version, right? There's Indeed, no roof. Indeed, yeah, so the roof's over in prep just on the other side of the factory. Well, this is the moment where the customisation happens. So, you know, our customers can select from a range of options and decide what configuration suits them. So every customer really gets to choose their own layout. Wouldn't that just drive you nuts and I guess also send you broke? Uh, well, it certainly would if you didn't design for it. And so we've very deliberately designed a modular system for this. This is the finished product. There's a lot of the uh, features of this van are controlled by an app. Get out, I can actually control what the lights. And there's a thing here that says locking drawers, so... Yeah, so it would be a huge disappointment to you to arrive at your campsite after a day of four-wheel driving and find the tomato sauce had been rolling up and down the floor. I'll tell you what, the interior of this thing has impressed me, but it is an off-road camper. Can we go take it off-road? I think we better. It's got to be able to go where the, uh, where the track takes you, and quite often the track is going to include a water crossing of some description. In this case, it's obviously... Uh, you know, quite a quite a deep oh, uh, no, in, puddle. In okay, so here we've got a bit of a, a hill. And, You're all nice and, and calm. I'm kind of like <laughs> freaking out here. <laughs> you know what I love about this is where great design, engineering, and fantastic manufacturing all come together as one. It's where the rubber hits the road. Uh, it's <laughs> where the rubber hits the dirt. Indeed. <laughs>